My daughter was attending um, Washington Liberty High School. She became very depressed and also very physically sick. So daily migraines, debilitating sickness. But some days she'd be okay, some days she wouldn't. Um, WNL was not working for that and we were at our wits end trying to figure out how she was gonna graduate. She was approaching her senior year. Um, and it just kind of, somebody said, have you thought about Langston? And I didn't even know what Langston was. I've lived in Arlington for 30 years. <clears throat> I had never heard of it. I had no idea what it was. Um, but I, ca I called the principal and said, well, it's kind of a strange situation. And he said, ma'am, all of our students are strange situations. That's what we're here for. And I felt like he saved her life by allowing her to come here. Uh, she could come as much as she could and do things at home if she couldn't. Um, and it just enabled her completely to graduate high school on time. Um, my daughter was already on a college prep track. Uh, Langston allowed her to continue that. Uh, they, the main thing that we loved about Langston was its flexibility. Um, when she was ill, her teachers excused her from class and sometimes even excused her from assignments if she was too ill to copy them um, and let her make things up or do other things on the side that she could do. Um, all with the knowledge that she was still applying to college, that we were still hoping to go to college. Um, so that was, that really academically, that boosted her up. It gave her more confidence. Um, WNL was just, it was not a good situation for her academically or socially. And a coming here was. She even knew a couple kids here from elementary school that they had all landed here together. And so she even knew people when she got here. So it was really nice. I mean, the teachers definitely kept in touch with her. She still had her device, and so they were working through COVID, giving her assignments of turning them in. Um, at that point, she was getting to graduation, and so we were dealing a little bit more at WNL as well. Uh, but I felt like COVID, I mean, COVID was awful for everybody, but I didn't feel like it was any worse here than it was for my other children who were in other schools. I felt like Langston rose to the challenge and still helped her to graduate. I would, I would describe it as warm and welcoming um, and very, um, very non-judgmental about why people were here because, of course, every child here has a story that's a little different from the mold. Uh, and, and so I felt like it was, it was a place where we could come and be ourselves and admit to the issues we were having both in her life and as a family and just everything that was going on for her and without any fear of judgment or that people were going to make fun of her or being mean to her um, that we had experienced. Those reactions we had experienced in other places didn't happen here. Uh, and so that was, that was a real testimonial to me to the success 